Alright, hello, hello, hello everyone, and welcome to this Roulette Rivals World Cup Group A match between Fanium and McCullers. Uh, sorry about the delay, it was just a... Uh... <coughs> yeah, I wasn't sure they were going to find an admin, so I went off and do my own thing, but... Yeah, we should be in time here, hopefully we can, um... Finish up this match and everything, and like, yeah, it will fit everyone's schedule. Yeah, I'm off to our first map, Colorado, in just under a minute. Uh, Fanium, it's been a very impressive 11, 2, and 1. Holding the record here as well. Um, the colors is uh, 1 win, 2 losses, 1 tie. Both players load up on the West Bridge chart, which is definitely the um, meta for Colorado. So once you get to the targets, the target with their longest cycle back to the house down. Yeah, here we have the first spin. We have Sean Rose, Fiberwire Scarecrow, Millie Graves, Kitchen Knife as Militia Spec Ops, Ezra Bear, Falling Object as Point Man, and Maya Profati SMG as Hacker. Alright. Millie Graves is no KO. So we likely see her as the last or second last kill here. Players will likely wait for her to get back to the house. Premium's already in, McClure's considering his loadout. This is a very... interesting spin. Upstairs for a quick hacker grab. Very nice. It has a play. Oh yeah. So with Fanium, you see Fanium, despite the fact that the uh, you have to bring in an SMG and that can shoot through doors. Fanium's still opting for the assault rifle there because yeah, shooting a door can be very annoying with the SMG. Lots of extended legal action. Yes. If anyone hears this, frontal KO here, probably not. Ooh, it was messing with the clock. Interesting. We might be getting Sean to come back to the house really early. That's that's interesting. I would like to see that. So he was caught messing with the clock by Penelope. That's true. You can know, cut down the back and forth. Oh, 
don't think Banium's not the kind of player who ever does any like super fast strats. He just insta loads in and does the the, the consistent strats. Version that beats like everyone except Scruffy, maybe. Scruffy in time, maybe. No plays were. Banium's playstyle doesn't work against. <laughs> Stuff would make the trip back for the hacker anyway. <laughs> uh, Scarf, I was just saying that, like, Banium could have done, like, fast strats here. You were saying that Banium could have done fast strats by um, Pika Moon Sean in, on, at the hay, like, at that stack of hay. But. And I was saying that like Banium's whole like playstyle just load in really fast and do the consistent strats works against everyone except like maybe you. Maya Parvati is down. Good work. Yeah, Banium just chugging through the spin, swaps in Mush Technician to grab the uh Grab the um, kitchen knife here. Yeah, who is messing with the clock here? Let's get Sean back to the house really quickly. That's definitely interesting. Grab a hack here. That could be potentially a lot faster, a lot less back and forth. You see Fanium. I care about Sean's guard, his tiny is hurry, but falling objects definitely not nicer than fall. Yep. Oh, oh! What is this for Fanium? Oh my god, how did he... Oh, but he's the only trust man. They all saw the body. <laughs> it was definitely... Yeah. I mean, you uh, was... A bit lucky, but also fainting with the fast hour action time there. <laughs> not sure if that was practiced or not. That was really fast. <laughs> oh, McCullers has the Maya isolation down. Fainting just absolutely chugging through the spin. Ooh, it's a little bit of panic. Yeah, but perfect. Yeah, but the panic clears just in, just as Pinocchi comes back to the house. Ooh. Oh. Oh, this is a little bit risky for Vanium, but I think, yeah, you get multiple chances on this peekaboo since. I don't know what weird late game logic is, but like she won't run off to find the guards. Um, ooh. It's kind of lost Penelope here. But yeah, I think it should be too long to be able to peek through her from like this other direction. Just wait for that. Oh, there's all these guards cycling through, which is scary. But another restart for Michael is I believe seen. Or oh, trying to grab the point man. Should be. Ooh. 
Let me try this again. about to turn around here sure what Phineon will try to do will you just get the kill here can you just get the kill here Ooh. Ooh. okay we're never going to go the right way this time all right if we have a rare um rare misplay for Phineon but yeah, still miles ahead here, and we'll take Colorado if we're a bit slower than as usual. <coughs> yeah, that'll love it too. It's definitely it's playing very well, but just coffee name just powers to every Colorado spin. The audio over to McClure's here. We see um Banium eight and five on um Sapienza. Holds the record. Who is one and nine? Interesting. The Dietrich Sapienza then. Just um so the shape of like I don't know, I guess I expected Makua's record to be better because he is like his profile picture is the hippie. But yeah. Surprise, but it's the record is so low. So you go, oh, he's doing this, um, he does every Sapienza. He practices the last year Lafayette grab and then he practices the folding knife grab. <laughs> Alright, that's crazy, wow. That's a crazy strat there dropping your sniper. Yeah, the spin here is, we'll be here in under 30 seconds. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. He's probably been practicing a lot, so we'll see what we got. Silvio Crusoe, Electrocution, Mansion Security, and Francesca DeSantis, Loud Assault Rifle, a Chef. Yeah, this is one of those interesting double mansion disguise spins. Who would play choose to start? Um, yeah, I see a safe house definitely a good start as well because of this loud assault rifle. I 
McClure's um, was set up with the um, EMP, but she's a swap over to the sniper. Interesting, because it is, like, you do have a large weapon in this fin. And you're playing very safe with this chef grab. Loadout is a little bit prohibiting of any tranks or anything. I hope you do that, Chef Graham. Mickler's not grabbing a chef, going straight up for Cheska. That's interesting. Uh oh. Yeah, it looks like he realized he forgot chef. That's not good. <coughs> well, that's not bad. Chef is coming towards him. Not be as huge a time loss. So we see Fanium doing the uh, double throw distraction into the ceiling. So Fanium's guards away. Save him. I feel a lot of time here, especially with this loud kill. Yeah, optimizing this uh, the Franny kill in our office is definitely one of the key parts of Sapienza. Clears up here, a little under a minute behind. Off for the tranks here. I'm not sure what makes French guard come in or not. Did he eat the dart? Uh oh. Is that guard coming in? See you gotta watch that dot. It looks like it's not. I'm not sure. It's like it's if Franny's like if you knock her all Franny's doing an animation, like not walking between the different parts of the office. You're fine. Ooh. Who's dragging the tranked guard? I think this would be soundproof. Ooh, it's forgotten his assault rifle. Team McClure's get the kill as well. Target down. Next up, Silvio Caruso. Fanium, essentially, no barriers here. Fanium gets the virus. Yeah, that's GG's. Let's see, at least, yeah, at least timing. So, like, he's missing. So, we yeah, just no chance. Oh, see, one buys the final map. That would be interesting. Team 7 and 2. Where's 2, 4, and 2? So both with lots of experience on this map. I just thought one mistake with Nicholas for getting the chef. <coughs> Excuse me.
Hmm. I'm gonna swap the audio back to premium for this last map. What Fanium is practicing? Okay. Um. Spin here in uh, 47 seconds. We have the spin. We have Wazir Kale, Loud Pistol is Taylor, Vanya Shah, Sniper Rifle is Lead Actor, and Dal Rangan SMG, No Pacification is Food Vendor. Alright. We have pretty standardish spin. <laughs> Very American spin. Nah. The uh, SMG is too small, it needs to be a shotgun. I guess you can't have double big weapons. <laughs> yeah, I think. I think I'm gonna get instantly loading in here. Should you saw it? It's doing Skywalk as well. Yeah, that's not a bad. It's not a bad play either. You can. So the only issue is would be the loud pistol. All the thugs are all carrying big weapons, so not really any opportunity for that. Forty-seven. Our intel suggests the maelstrom is hiding somewhere in the city swamps. I've marked the hole that has been closed on your map. Oh yeah, Vanya's Vanya's guards are they carry pistols. So as if you wanted to do Dawa's guard, actually no, Dawa's guard is carry SMGs, don't they? That's the maelstrom. You found him. Start with you get the um here, and then you get a lead actor. Uh, third will turn, I think. No! Okay, I guess they didn't even knew that. It's far enough. Interesting look, 47. Well, Darwood Rangan is at the tower expecting Mr. Yeah, both players doing the same here. No need to keep him waiting. Be last has to be last. Yeah. Taylor is a spy. I spoke to his employee that Mr. Wants to meet with him, but he claims that the tailor wasn't available. Can you 
has to be last. Find out what kind of dress a woman like Vanya Shaw wants. Whoa! Oh, Vanium. Yeah, this guy's been forcing downstairs. Yeah, I never gone back that way. Yeah, Nicholas Moonwhile opting to um, get everyone knocked out first. Oh, he rips as well. Yeah, this guy's a forcer. Both players restarting. Oh. Okay, they didn't bring loud pistol. All right. I guess you couldn't bring really bring. You gotta bring pistol SMG sniper rifle. There's a lot of pistol in the trolls, but hmm, would not start trolls for this spin. Definitely like you grab lead actor. You stash in the middle workers, you grab Taylor. You run birth lead actor, Taylor. Get the lead actor kill, bring Taylor over to Dawood. And be food vendor. What kind of dress a woman like Vanya Shah wants? Greetings, sir. Can I interest you in my fine wares? Cheap, durable cloth, and any special color. I think Fanium is heading back to Taylor to Maelstrom. Yeah, it's not too long a trip, but it's only 10 20 seconds. Ah, he's the, yeah, this guy. Oh, this guy's a lot pistol. Very nice from Fanium. Very nice knowledge from Fanium. Oh, that was a little bit of orange, of yellow there. No external evil. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one. And has lead actor in his way. Does he have a stash in the map? Yeah, I think he stashed his sniper by the uh, train tracks. Oh, Mickler's going up for Dawid. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, kind of equal IGTs. This is interesting. Okay, Dawid coming down right now. Got some sort of strat. How does lean over that railing? Let's see what happens next, 47. 47? Oh my leg. And I think this is fantastic because it's just how long you have to wait for Dotwood. Oh. New strats. Oh yeah, this peekaboo is. Because I think you can't point the gun at him. Oh. Okay. Guys will follow, right? This is. Oh, and then a panic. 
Oh my god. This is, uh... Oh my lord. There's guards? Yeah, if you dump that body, he will get found, right? I'm not sure what happens with the body afterward. Oh, oh, he's just a little bit. Shoot him in the body. Yes. Oh, yeah, make him fall. Does he make a noise if he just falls naturally? Oh? Is there no? Yeah, no one sees that. Oh my lord. Don't, don't fuck it up. Oh my god, he fucks it up. No! No! <laughs> oh, that was such a highlight. That's definitely a good strategy. <laughs> yeah. So you shoot him into the shaft, then he like... There's no noise. So the body is made. Yeah, that could be quite good. Three minutes, if you can get like a really early... It was like Vanya Bollywood crew or something? Bolly Bo Bollywood bodyguard? That'd be an insane strat. Like Vanya painter or something like that? Like the right set of disguises? Hume Tranks this guard, be very safe. If he will. Yeah, he's going for full snail thing. Yeah, because there's no pistol for the uh little distract. Nor the six trap of McLeary stuff. Good day. No. Oh, uh, we scream. I don't think anyone heard that. Or the guy upstairs. I don't think so. Man, that was such a cool strap in my place. Like, yeah, just the exit's very sketchy. Yeah, there we go. Vanium finishes. And we'll complete the sweep on uh, winning 6 0. GG's. I'm gonna highlight that already. Uh, Someone had that was the uh, Vanium exiting the house in Colorado. Anyways, so just a quick look at the group's standings. I'll update that. The only way I know how. Uh, that's 2022. Ignore that. Interact. A. Okay, this Vanium. Yeah, this is the last match, right? So we only played four matches. Vanium's still perfect. A wins and Micklers, but Micklers are still doing very well. As we already see here, Bull W already being eliminated. However, there's still Peter Dunn. There's still a lot of room for movement in this group because Peter Dunn has not played any of their matches yet. Yeah, we can see, like, this is a very competitive group, potentially. We see Peter and Gamorichek, McLeary's Osh, all very close to each other. Yeah, um, so for upcoming matches, let me check. And 20, yeah, I like him as Fusk is happening right now, so I'll go host that. And there's also uh, Aphrodite vs. Mika in about an hour. Yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. And yeah, I'm gonna go raid who's casting that. Crazy for Daisy, right? E. Let's make sure I'm raiding the right one. You right the channel. Crazy for Daisy. Here we go. Yeah, thanks for watching and um have a rest of your day.